Qin Shi Huang ordered the construction of a massive tomb guarded by life-size clay figures, a terracotta army meant to accompany him to the afterlife. But you probably don't realize the sheer scale of the undertaking involved to produce the 40,000 weapons buried with the emperor. Completed around 210 BCE, most of the sculptures were outfitted with genuine weapons, smith, sharpened, and polished into battle-ready equipment. Most of the weapons were made from high-quality bronze, however, some iron examples also exist within the tomb. When researchers analyzed the metal of the combat-ready weapons under an electron microscope, they noticed grinding and polishing marks that revealed an interesting detail about how these numerous weapons were made. The marks on the weapons found with the terracotta army are consistent with rotary lathe technology technology, a technology important for mass manufacturing. The weapons found with the terracotta army mark one of the earliest known uses of rotary lathes for industrial-like scale production in the world, occurring more than 2,000 years ago.